Hello, this is Thibaut for another video. Today we're gonna see uh, pin and Im images reveal. So let's see how it looks like. So I have this page and I'm scrolling and I have some images that are revealing together with the text coming, sliding in view. And then it's finishing. I'm coming back once again. So you can see the text is somehow synchronized with the images. And let's see how it's made. So first, as usual, the um, bricks composition so i have as usual the dummies uh, section the start and the end so we can see the effect of the pin element so i'm pinning this section in motion page so i give the class of background color pin and in this section i have my container and i have two blocks one is the block of text so with the heading and the button and the one with the Im images so each div actually you, you can see on the screen but on the layout they have a position absolute so they are sitting on top of each other it's the same for the images the images have a position absolute and they are sitting on top of each other so there are some settings but i, I won't go through the details as usual uh, i will provide with the uh, bricks template the json and i will give also the mo motion page template with the animation so what i'm doing so pin effect so i'm using scroll trigger lock to scroll bar yes pin element is as i said the background color pin top zero percent bottom minus hundred percent and i'm giving somehow some friction so it's uh, doesn't go too fast i'm giving a friction of 300 percent then as you can see also the background is changing color so this last time I show you in another video how to do that, but today I'm making a, it in another way. So I have the section with the background color pin class, and I'm just changing the background from one color, so green, to another, this color. Then second one is I'm starting with the same color and I'm moving to another one and same for the third one I'm moving from this color to the last one so actually I have four colors then I'm also um, animating the text so I'm starting from minus 200 VH for the first one but the second one is minus 100 VH so why I'm giving the minus 200 VH is because the, the, the other one are from 100 VH to minus 100 VH. So if I want to give them the same speed, uh, because the animation is equally long, I'm giving the, the, the space of 200 VH. So from minus 100 to uh, from 100 to minus 100 VH. And same for the th the other text and the last one also 200 vh and the slides so the images i'm animating through a clip path so insert parenthesis zero 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 two Inset zero zero hundred percent and zero. 
So that's the effect. If you look at the slide, it's slightly appearing step by step. Then the next one and the last one. So we can see another time the animation. Oh, by the way, I can show you also on, uh, let's see. Uh, on another screen size. Okay, so I hope you, you enjoy the video. I hope you learned something and uh, see you to another see you at another video. Thank you, bye bye.